Hello everybody. It is Monday and it's uh it was a pretty slow day. I'm insulted by my physics teacher because I was falling asleep in class because I went to sleep at like eleven last night and I know that's that's kinda early for most of you guys, but for me that's really late because I had to get up at six in the morning. So I'm home now. I had filming to do today for a play that's going on at the school, so I'm just at home writing on myself with Sharpie. I got the X, I got Jack, and I drew this. Rise up and above. I don't know if you can read the above, but whatever. So, big thing to talk about today. Everything was going pretty slow today, and then after school, I got this. If, ah, uh, dang it. I got this letter. Now, if you watched yesterday's vlog, I talked all about the SOAR program and ways that we could improve it. This girl went out of her way to write every one of my ideas to our principal, and she gave me a copy of the letter. I don't know if you can see her name, but she deserves some credit, because that's, that's amazing. She went and took all of my ideas, even put my name down here at the bottom, if you can see it. There it is. In a great inspiration in my life, Jacob Townsend. That's that's just really, really cool. That I feel like I'm making a statement for the school. Because I'm one of the guys who is among the people who don't like the SOAR program. And it's not because I just think it's flat out stupid. I see what you're trying to do, honestly. I see what the SOAR program is going for. But you're not making it what we need. Or not what we need, what we want. It's, it is a need. It is a big need. We do need some type of bullying program, but we don't want this one because this one's too harsh. As she stated, this is a very sensitive topic to many people, me included, but I feel it's taken too harshly. I'm just suggesting not talking about people killing themselves or bullying. And that's so true. We need to make this something where we point out kids who have been bullied a ton of their life but were able to overcome it by not, not abusing drugs and alcohol, not doing that kind of stuff, overcoming it, finding a cool hobby to do. I overcame bullying by starting my filmmaking because I could express myself in any way. I listened to really, really hardcore music because if I was angry, I could listen to my music, and I would just be singing my music. I'm not just screaming in general. I'm doing. I'm listening to screaming music, so I can just scream my music. I know it's kind of weird, but it's what I do. So, I am planning on starting a Facebook page about all of this. I'm not sure what I'm going to call it yet, but I will. If you guys have suggestions, leave them down below. I'm just going to start with a basic kind of like we want to change sore. Or get rid of bullying. It's going to have sore in the name or something. It'll be like change sore. I'm not sure yet. But if you have a good name for it. Leave it down below in the comments. Because I really really want to hear it. There is one thing she did leave out of this letter though. And it's not a huge thing to leave this out. But it could really really help. And that is. Before a teacher. Or should I say the teachers. Go and think of some kind of field trip for bullying. Or think of some things to do at the bullying assemblies. Send out a survey of everything you plan to do with other options. And let the students decide. That way they'll want to pay attention to what you're saying. You have to get students' opinion on things before you just go off and do stuff. Or else students aren't going to like what you're doing. Students don't always agree with what the teachers want. So... Get their opinion first. And I'm sure, I'm sure it'll help someone. It's got to help a little bit at least. Anyways, I'm going to go because uh, Ralphie Mae is on downstairs. <laughs> it's kind of a dumb reason to be leaving this. But this is going to be my topic for the next few days. It might be actually until next week when I go to this week of nonviolence thing. So you know what? Thumbs up and support the change of SOAR. And I know mainly people who go to my school and all about this stuff. So, I need to make vlogs for the people who are out of out of our state, or not in our school who watch these things. But, yeah. Go like the page. We need to change SOAR. Please. 
we need all the support we can get. When I go to this week of nonviolence thing and I and I'm all set to pitch my ideas, I want as much support as possible. In fact, if you're watching this, let's see if you guys can write letters as great as this. I want I need a survey sent out. I'm going to se I'm going to start some kind of petition or something. But anyways, like I said, I'm going to go. So links to my main channel, my second channel, everything is down below. There's a Facebook, a Twitter, and a No Google Plus down there. And make sure you check out the Classified Productions when they appear in our movie, Dog Tags 3. Dog Tags 2 is still in production. I will see you guys tomorrow. Transition.